Hello, everybody, and welcome to the inaugural USA Science and Engineering Festival. This weekend, you're joining more than a million people on the National Mall and across the country to celebrate science and engineering, innovation and invention, and some of the most exciting discoveries of the 21st century. Earlier this week, I had some fun kicking off the festival with a science fair at the White House that recognized the young winners of our nation's top science and technology competitions. I was inspired to meet these extraordinary young men and women working on everything from a new design for a solar-powered car to a promising approach for treating cancer. It's pursuits like these that uncover new talents and light the passions of tomorrow's scientists, engineers, inventors, and entrepreneurs. And that creativity, that fire, is what's going to power our country forward, leading us to create the industries, jobs, and technologies of the future, develop new sources of clean energy, and make the discoveries that will allow us to lead longer, healthier lives. That's not just the power of science. That's the promise of America. And so my hope is that this festival is just the beginning for all of you and that you stay involved by visiting usasciencefestival.org. If you're a parent, encourage your child to tinker and to experiment. If you're a teacher, start a festival in your own community. If you're a scientist or engineer, open your laboratory and mentor a young person. And if you're a young person, keep exploring. Keep asking questions. Keep having fun. The future of this country and the advancements of the next century are in your hands. None of us know what new breakthroughs might come from an idea that hatches this weekend. But we can dream, and I have a feeling that's just what a lot of you are doing. I hope you have fun exploring this festival, and maybe I'll see some of you and your discoveries at the White House next year.